started, please excuse the mane. I'm having a bad hair day today. So I just kind of threw it up in a headband. But let's not let that get in the way <clears throat> for this beautiful Rihanna inspired tutorial. La! All right, so I'm just going to start off um, with NYX's um, Milk Jumbo Pencil. And I'm just going to kind of sketch that onto my lid um, up into my crease. But you don't have to go all out because this this stuff is really creamy and spreadable, if you will. And then we're gonna go with a color called Samoa Silk, which is like a really um like a peachy, a super peachy, like pastel orange. And I'm just gonna take my 224 blending brush, grab some of that product and pop it right into the crease and up to the mid-tone and almost until the brow highlight as well. Okay, so now I'm going to use my 224 again and take a little bit of shale, which is like a, it's almost like a, a taupey kind of violet frosty color. And it can almost look gray too. And we're gonna pop that into the crease as well. And then we're gonna take a flat brush, 242, and a color called Retrospec, which is a very beautiful, um, a luster, shiny color. <laughs> and then we're gonna pop that onto the lid. Dab a little bit into your inner eye as well. Okay. And then for a brow highlight, we're going to do a little bit of rice paper, which is like another frosty kind of gold color. I really like gold. And take that under the brow. Um, concentrate it more like right underneath the arch and just bring it down and then we're gonna buff that out a little bit and then grab some retrospect and pop that baby right on top I'm just gonna pump up my lashes do some really thin um, liquid liner with a little bit of a wing Pop some eyeliner underneath as well, and then we'll get the lashes on because the lashes are so pretty. I know I haven't really done a tutorial on applying lashes, so I guess this will be the tutorial on applying lashes or a little snippet. All right, so you're going to take the glue. I'm using the dark tone duo um, and when you apply the glue you kind of want to squeeze a little out at a time while applying it to the rim of the lash <clears throat> and you don't want to give it a good crazy squeeze because it'll come gushing out and you will be in an overabundance of glue. So you just kind of want to coat the rim of the lash with the glue and you need to use a surgical um, adhesive lash glue, specific eyelash glue. You can't use no Elmer's glue. What I like to do is I like to curl my lashes, my natural lashes, and um, load them up with mascara first. So it kind of creates like a little cradle of where I can place my false lash. So see that little, the little cradle. So I'm going to take my lash, two fingers, and just lay it right into that crevice. 
that I showed you. And then once it's in there, you're just going to press it into your natural lashes. All right, so for a blush, I'm going to be using um, NYX's Blush in Cinnamon. And then I'm going to be using MAC in Petal Point, which is that frosty pink color, my fave. And then um, a Belightful Belight Highlighter Powder, which is dying. So I'm going to grab a little bit of the NYX onto my blush brush. And I'm going to use this color to kind of sculpt out my cheeks. And then I'm going to grab um, Petal Point, which is the MAC Pink Frost blush. And I'm going to go right on top of that. for the pretty like bright cheeks. And then I'm gonna take some Belightful and pop it right into the middle. The middle of my cheek. And a little down the nose. So I'm gonna powder my lips because sometimes they tend to be too pink and the true color of the lipstick doesn't really show. And then we're going to use um, Cranberry Lip Liner from MAC. Lustering Lipstick from MAC as well. We've, we've used this in the past, I think, with the, the Look of Spring tutorial. And then we're going to use um, Palatial Luster Glass. So pretty. <laughs> There you have it, the Rihanna inspired um, makeup from the Billboard Awards. <laughs>